Thank you for joining me today. My name is Dwight Mashburn. I am the general manager here at Mashburn Transportation Services. Today I'd like to talk to you about the difference between an in-dump and a belt trailer. When I think of in-dumps, I think of hazards. One hazard being, anytime a load has, has any moisture in it, we have to line the trailer for the load to come out evenly and properly so the trailer doesn't tip over. Now when the driver has to line the trailer, he has to climb up the side of the trailer, being 10 or 12 feet up in the air, get inside and line the trailer. Now not only is this a hazard to the employee, but it's also an additional cost and each load can add up to quite a bit. Now a second hazard is overhead power lines. Anytime that truck booms up in the air to unload, that's a hazard of hitting overhead power lines. Now we all know that there's policies and procedures in place so this doesn't happen. But any time that there's a human error, it could be fatal. Now, a third hazard with end dumps is the unloading. Everybody knows about end dumps tipping over. Well, any time that there's an uneven surface, a soft surface, a sinking surface, it's windy, or the load sticks, that trailer has a possibility of going over. Now, don't get me wrong. End dumps can be operated safely if properly. After watching that, what if I told you all those hazards and human errors could be eliminated? Now watch this next video and you decide which trailer is safer. Now as you can see, belt trailers are a lot safer than end dumps. A belt trailer you do not have to line, nor does the employee have to climb inside the trailer. This also eliminates the costs that come with liners. Since a belt trailer doesn't boom up into the air, we lo no longer have the hazards that come with overhead power lines. We can also unload on uneven surfaces, in soft surfaces, and in windy conditions as where end dumps can. Now, a belt trailer can haul just about anything an end dump can. It can haul up to 80% moisture, such as drill cuttings, or dirt, or gravel, or anything like that. The only thing it can't haul is concrete, boulders, and hazardous loads. Now, MTS has several brand new belt trailers along with professional drivers that are trained. 
Thank you for joining us today as we demonstrated the difference between an end dump and a belt trailer. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to contact us. Thank you.